What is this vicious circle of loyalty? OK, so people always ask me what the best loyalty scheme is, and many people think it's Boots Advantage card, because that gives you four points worth of penny back per pound of spend. Now, indeed, that is relatively generous. So, if there were an item that cost two pounds in Boots and two pounds in Superdrug, 4p, 4% per spend actually means this one costs £1.92 because you're getting 4% off. This one costs £2, buy it in boots. But if it cost £1.80 in super drug and £2 in boots, forget the loyalty card, go for where it's cheaper. So the golden rule first is never choose where you shop because you've got a loyalty card. Right. But every, if you're shopping somewhere that has a loyalty card, use it because this is the vicious circle of loyalty. You've earned your points. Here you go. Mm, no You've earned your points. Sounds like a Robert De Niro right? film. How it? do you redeem your points? You have to go back and spend at that shop. When you spend at that shop, you tend not to just spend your points. You tend to buy other things in there, which means you earn more points. How do you redeem those points? You've got to go back into the shop. When you go back in that shop, you tend not just to spend the points, you tend to spend more than the points. So you get more points. How do you redeem those? And so what they do is trap you into a circle of spending Why at the same it, place. It's like a lovely bonus present. And as long as it's only a lovely bonus and it's not dictating where you shop, that's fine. Okay. I'm not anti-points, I'm just don't choose where you shop just because you've got the right, multi-card. what are the best schemes? That's what they want you to do. And they data mine you too, all these firms. They means they know loads about you and try and target you. They know loads of information about you too. That's one of the points of loyalty. Um,